So we all love Pluto, we all love Zumo, we all love the Roku channel because they provide free ad supported television. For someone who's on a budget, who's looking to truly cut the cable cord, those are some of the best options out there. Well, we know that YouTube has YouTube TV. However, YouTube may be entering a space where it provides free cable-like television, ad-supported cable-like television, and it's set to compete with those services that I just mentioned. So we're gonna jump into the details. But before we do, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, smash the notification bell, let's go. So this video is gonna be pretty short. Uh, like I said, whenever we talking about services that we don't have to pay for that's ad supported that's going to save you some money definitely worth spreading the word about so youtube is testing a hub free cable style channel that will compete with those other services that i mentioned let's go ahead and jump into the article this is from engadget i'll go ahead and link the full article in the description youtube is reportedly in talks with media companies for their tv shows and films in a hub of ad supported channels it's already testing the idea to weigh views interest so the platform could roll out the hub to more users later this year according to the wall street journal so if youtube moves forward with this plan it will be entering the market known in the industry as free ad supported streaming television or fast i've never called it fast players in the space include roku and we know about the roku channel ton of free content there we know about tubi another great one pluto tv which is owned by paramount global or formerly known as viacom cbs one that they left out is zumo which is similar so depending on what content is offered and how it sets up the mood of channel youtube could end up pulling more attention away from those services so youtube confirmed in the journal that it's running tests in which small number of users can watch ad supported channels and this is what they said so we're always looking for new ways to provide users a central destination to more easily find watch and share content that matters most to them a spokeswoman said yes those channels are great and you know the user interface is going to be different depending on which one you like using anyone who has multiple applications you know that for the most part those channels are going to be similar and sometimes even identical so Tubi may have 200 channels Pluto TV may have 300, but what we see is that at least 150 of those channels are going to be the exact same. So uh, these companies that own the media, they're selling it to whoever wants it. That way they can pull revenue from different streams. All right, so the, the service is set to team up with likes of uh, Lionsgate, A&E Networks, and Films Rise for the test. Such channels offer a way for them to earn revenue from content that might otherwise languish. Uh, YouTube already offers ad-supported movies, but the hub could give users a bigger platter of free films and shows to watch. So we all know that if you go on YouTube and you can search for whatever, you can watch it. Uh, you are going to get those ad interruptions, but for the most part, you can find a lot of shows just searching on YouTube. So channels could operate in a similar way to Pluto TV. That platform has channels dedicated to reruns, certain shows such as CSI, Doctor Who, South Park, Frasier, along with ones for reality series. So live news and even some sports. I'm not gonna be those NFL games or NBA games that um, we want. The Mo Movie into Fast aligns with the YouTube strategy of expanding into their video formats beyond the content that's traditionally associated with the platform. In November, it broke premium streaming channels out of YouTube TV and onto the main app. Showtime, Stars, Paramount Plus, and AMC Plus were amongst the first primetime channels. Most recently, YouTube locked down exclusive rights to NFL Sunday ticket package in a multi-billion dollar deal set to run for seven years so another free streaming service ad supported free streaming service coming your way pretty soon and uh, like i said i can name off a few we have zumo pluto we have the roku channel we have tubi we have some other ones great to have a lot of different options however for the most part a lot of these channels are going to be similar in the comments let me know what your thoughts are uh, is just having this content on youtube versus having to download a separate app is that beneficial are you not a fan of youtube housing this content drop your thoughts in the comments if you're new to the channel subscribe hit the notification bell thank you for watching and i'll catch you on the next one